sorry we are going to see about the tool netcat why i am telling you this netcat is very important for you it means see if you are making a remote code or execution or if you are gaining a reversal from your target then how you start listening okay so even if you are uh, confusing for a listening scenario we take the scenario of a reversal and bind shell so i'll just take this as an example so construct this is this one is attacker and this is victim okay so attacker and victim okay see now attacker needs to hack the victim system how it is possible so for that attacker need to create a virus so using this virus only attacker can able to control the victim system okay so now here attacker is creating a virus and send it to victim so the virus is going from whom to whom super from attacker to victim because attacker only create the virus victim will have a create the virus okay so virus is going from attacker to victim generally okay so if it is a reversal based virus means what happen it makes a victim system will come and connect with attacker system okay so reverse means yeah that's it's a vice versa virus is going from attacker to victim it's reverse means it's vice versa victim will come and connect with attacker victim system will come and connect with attacker system so for this who need to make a listen means attacker need to listen for the connection wait for the connection so listening is nothing but waiting okay attacker needs to wait for the connection because victim system is coming and connect with attacker so attacker needs to wait for the connection attacker start the listener this is generally happen in reverse shell okay so virus is generally going from attacker to victim if it is a reverse shell virus means victim system will come and connect with attacker system so for this attacker is waiting in their side okay attacker is waiting for the connection attacker is listening for the connection the same thing in a bind shell see okay if it is a bind shell means what happened once if victim executed the bind shell virus it opens some port in a victim machine okay once if the victim executed the bind shell virus it open the specific port in a victim machine so whenever the attacker needs the connection attacker system go and connect with the victim system in bind shell okay in reverse shell victim system will come and connect with attacker system in bind shell that virus make open some specific port in a victim device and whenever attacker needs the connection attacker system go and connect with the victim system in bind shell okay in bind shell who is waiting for the connection okay attacker system go and connect with the victim system so who is waiting for the connection attacker will go and connect with the victim then who is waiting for the connection victim only listening see victim only open the port and start the listening because victim listening means the virus in the victim system open a specific port in victim device and start listening okay so whenever the attacker need connection attacker system go and connect with the victim system this is actually in a okay name. so if it is a reverse shell means who listening for the connection in reverse shell so yes okay in reverse shell attacker listen for the connection bind shell victim listen for the connection in reverse shell attacker wait for the connection and in bind shell victim wait for the connection see if you are found there is a code execution vulnerability in the application so what generally attackers will do using a code or execution so attacker can uh, can like to gather the shell okay so attacker can get the reverse shell from the target so if attacker getting a reverse shell from the target what attacker needs to do attacker needs to listen for the connection okay attacker needs to listen for the connection so for example see there is an application which is vulnerable to remote code execution and i am the attacker what i'll do i execute the payload in victim system so using the payload i get the reverse connection from my side okay so if i if i am performing the reverse connection or reverse shell then what i need to do as an attacker i need to start listening from my side so if i start listening from my side then only i can able to get the connections